Hello YouTube, this is Mike and Ike here, and today I'm actually going to be talking about something kind of interesting, um, something a little different. So today I'm actually talking about how the DualSense is probably the best pad controller you can play on outside of, um, you know, actual peripheral design. Not really taking that too much into consideration, but I'm also talking about latency. So I have a, uh, a window here displaying all the Sony controller latencies right now, right? And I think I think this assumes a thousand pulling rate or, you know, or so, something like that. Or maybe less, I don't know. But, anywho, pretty much, um, to keep it brief, the DualShock 5 or DualSense, whatever you want to call it, if you have it wired USB, and I'm assuming this is on PC, um, and pulling, to, uh, I think it's a thousand pulling rate or whatever, um, it's 1.809, um, MS in latency, right? That is very good, especially compared to DualShock 4. Um, this is version 2, I believe. It's, it's, uh, it's actually 3.56, so it's actually about, you're getting, um, you're getting faster latency here, right? And on top of that, you can actually overclock your controller on PC, and I'll actually link the video in the description um, that shows you how to overclock the dual sense. And it's funny, the dual sense is so fast. If you overclock it too high, you're it might actually mess up games. So uh, to be on the safe side, I overclocked mine to 500 um, pulling rate, um, and it and it feels so fucking smooth. Honestly, you can just overclock it to 250, and it's still really good. You can just get one MS. But I, I did 500 um, just just to see how it felt um, with fighting games, and, and it, it didn't feel like any didn't feel bad or anything. So yeah, um, here's the dual sense here. Um, I'm gonna compare this to some other controllers too. So let's compare this to. Let me see if I can. Uh, let's go to Microsoft. So let's see if we can find. So the Xbox. Um, look at this, the Elite Series Two. This is a hundred plus dollar controller. 6ms right that that's worse than the dual shock for that's worse than the dual sense um let's see 5 5.9 5 ms i think this is the uh, current controller the series controller um for the series x this is 5.59 it's way it's just way worse um not way worse but it's it's worse latency wait it's worse latency um sure i mean if the controller is comfortable to you play whatever you want but in terms of latency, the dual sense is probably the best um, pad controller. I'm not taking hitbox or anything into consideration. Just speaking control like pad, gamepad controllers into consideration here. I'm not sure what the least likely one is. According um, according to Arturo Sanchez, um, NYC Furby, I think it is the dual sense. I could be wrong though. But I think it is the dual sense. Um, there is some other like controllers that might be really like this i don't know what this is this is only 0.662 this is crazy i'm not sure what that controller is but yeah in terms of like um readily available controllers that you can just buy like pretty easily i would say the dual sense is the um best controller i'm not sure if they have hitbox on here i can i can take a look um let's see i don't think they do because i think the the thing with hitbox is like um yeah, I don't think they have it. I mean, look at Hori, though. Hori fight coming in, that's a controller. Um, it's not bad. Um, 2.904 isn't terrible. If you overclock this, you could probably get it to, like, 1 MS, to be honest. Um, same thing with, uh, this one's pretty good, too. So, uh, Hori fight commander's up there, I would say. Um, you know, this is because take a PC into consideration. I think all consoles are different. But, um... Yeah, I would say the closest one other than the dual sense is the Hori, from what it looks like here. There maybe there's some other controllers, but uh overall though, I would say in terms of latency, the dual sense is the controller, the most common controller that you can grab that you'd want to go for. Um, and that's really it. If you have any questions, let me know. And see you guys later. Peace out.